All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. NBA 2K21, man, look, man, we got a lot of stuff going on in the joint today, man. A lot of little opinions, things like that. And we're going to get to the bottom of it. We're going to talk to it, talk about it, talk about all of it. We got your boy Swante weighing in twice on a couple of things. You know, we got we, we didn't talk about the mayor joint because I ended up having to go out yesterday. I'll tell y'all more about that. And then, uh, so Ronald 2K held the mayor joint, blah, 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 yakety, smackety. And last but not least, your boy Power DF. He's weighing in on affiliations, and we're going to hit y'all with the only opinions that matter. So if y'all do nothing else, make sure y'all like the video, man, because every time you like the video, it helps us get up in the algorithm and helps us get seen and, you know, maybe more people to subscribe and blah, 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 all that good stuff. Anyway, man, let's just get right into the video. Ain't nobody got time for all that. Leo! If you make it to C25, that's OG status. I was told you could be anything, just don't be average. Down bad, flat pockets, that shit made me upset. Start hustling nonstop, don't plan on breaking that head. All right, so if you have been on the rock the last couple of days, you know that they had the Ronnie 2K Mayor Showdown on yesterday. And uh, let's just show y'all right here, man. Boom. Uh, last night, watched the 2v2 Mayor Battle where you had Poor Boy Sin and T-Jack versus Mo Buckets and iPod King Carter. Be there or be square. See me there, beat me there, meet me there, or beat me there, all that other good stuff. Be there or be square. All right, so look, man. Let's just be real with it, man. Look at, look at, look at who they had, bro. They had iPod and Mo Buckets versus uh, T Jack and Poor Boy Sam, bro. On what, on what planet is this fair? I'll wait. Y'all, let me know what the team should have been down in the comment section. I think it should have been uh, iPod and Sam versus Mo Buckets and T Jack. That at least that would have been balanced. Cause y'all know it ain't no way in God Green's Earth that. Mo Buckets and iPod King Carter are gonna beat the Kings of Comp in, in Po' Boy Sin and T-Jack. Like, Po' Boy Sin play more games than anybody every single year. Now, he's been taking a break lately. He said on Twitter he going through a few things. We ain't worried about that. He ain't lose, he ain't lose his ability to flick the sticks. You understand what I'm saying? He took that big of a break. He ain't been out the game that long. He still knows how to ISO. He still know how to get a bucket anytime he wants to. He's still an elite defender. T-Jack, you still can't stay in front of him. He still got the T-Jack walk back and pull. Like, what? Oh, what planet was this? Mo Buckets, like, I probably got a guard. He had his regular guard out there. You know, he was going, he was getting buckets here and there when they allowed him to. We'll get into that in a second. And Mo Buckets, you know, he got his 6-7 Demi. And come on, man. Am I the only one that, that feel like I know how to box that 6-7 Demi by now? Because, like, when you play against, like, a lot of people say that guards ain't that important in the game. When you play against guards over and over and over, especially in uh, Rec and in Pro-Am, when you see a 6-7 Demi, does it not look like they're moving in slow motion? And it's just like, well, you're never going to get a shot off on me. You might get a, a blow-by animation and go to the rim on me or something like that. You're never getting a three on me. Am I the only one that feel like that? Now, I got a guard. A lot of people say that, you know, it ain't no need to have guards in the game. I got a 6'6 six, six point guard. I got a 6'7 power forward. I feel like there's a distinct difference in how they move. I'm going to make a 6'7 guard, point guard or maybe a 6'7 shooting guard. But I really feel like guards move faster than other ones. Anyway, these are the spoils of war that y'all seeing right here, bro. We're seeing, you know, that um, we're seeing right here that these are the courts that they got. And I'm not going to cap to you. These might be the hardest courts <laughs> out there, bro. I ain't going to lie. Fire, boy. So, you know, we pulled up Disrespectful and uh, just checked it out or what have you. But, you know, it just sucks because uh, I was out there early in the morning. It was before it was before the event yesterday, so hardly anybody was out there. So, you know how that goes. But y'all let me know down in the comment section how unfair that was. Because, bro, that wasn't fair. Let's be real. It just wasn't fair. Up next, we got my boy Swante. People talking about going back to 2K uh, current gen. I want to do some current gen videos. I actually got a rage with Randoms Teller 2, Teller 3 gens today. It's going to be me. I'm going to go back to, I'm downloading uh, 2K20 right now because my boy Bird. That, you know, he keep telling me, hey, drop that 2K20 content and see it go crazy. So we're we going to go 2K20 and we're going to go with um, 2K, uh, we're going to go with 2K20, uh, 2K21 current, and then this one to see whose randoms are the worst. But my boy Swante said, this community is weird. It doesn't really matter how bad next gen is. I mean, next, I mean, next gen is. There's literally Zans on current, like auto green lights. I don't know how y'all mentally play games that are infested with cheaters. 
I'd lose it. And that's real, bro, because you see people playing, and then, like, uh, the guy tweeted, he tweeted at him, he was like, bro, just look at this right here. Like, look at, look at this, bro. People got ads. Look at this strike pack ad on TikTok. What? Look at this. Dribble, 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 dribble. Here you go. Dribble, 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 dribble. Auto green. Like, come on, man. Man, come on, man. And then they got the pack, the strike pack, and all that. Like, like bro, like, this is what I was saying, too. It doesn't matter how bad the current gen game is. If you got people that's out there that are cheating, and we know that they're cheating, I can't deal with it, man. Like, and then, like, the thing is, the funny thing is, people keep sending me messages talking about that I'm using the Zen and stuff like that. And some people say that they, uh, I got, I keep getting messages that they have figured out a way to Zen, current Zen. And I, I, I'm, I'm, I mean, I'm, I'm looking and I don't see anybody really using it. I don't know if anybody's using it. I think people probably were using it on the face and stuff. My boy 2K Toots came back and said, hey, AJ, uh, the timing might not, it's not the same and stuff like that. So maybe they can't even use it on the face, but I think that would be the only thing because even if you're kind of close on the face, then it still gives it to you. You hit those big old, you hit them big whites or whatever. I don't know, man. It is what it is. But like I said, the Zen's back and better than ever on current gen. I don't want none of that, man. Let me know if you still want. Like, I know some people can't get current gen. One dude in the comment section was like, you lame for that, that uh, you wild, or you, you know, you lame for that uh, current gen comment. Bro, it's not my fault that you can't get next gen, bro. I don't care if nobody can't get next gen. It ain't your right to get next gen. You understand what I'm saying? Just like it's not my right to get a Mercedes. That's just like me saying, you know, they say Mercedes are the safest cars in the world. Oh, y'all shouldn't say that because everybody can't get a Mercedes. Do you think Mercedes care? Bro, let me let me tell you something. The world don't care about you. And in most cases, I don't either. So we try to act like we care about each other and blah, blah, blah. But let me know, if you really care that much about somebody, who giving up their PlayStation or their next-gen console to somebody that can't get it? I'll wait. Bro, we already know the answer to that. So the world don't care about you in most cases, neither do I. And the internet damn sure don't care about you. You can get it. And you know why we know that that's the case? Because these these scalpers, they really don't care about you. They sit, they are really sitting out there scalping these joints, making it so y'all can't get it. And then, they, then you want to come and express your, ah, ah, Jay-Z, you shouldn't make a man. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Like hard eight times. Say, man, ain't nobody studying that mess, man. Up next. I love my boy Hard Eight Time. Shout out to him, man. Go take his channel out. Up next, man. Power D up. Unpopular opinion. Affiliations in, in next gen make the game worse. It divides people, and uh, and you can't even go play other affiliations without losing rep. Rival Day and Mayor is cool, but it's not worth how much it hurts the community. You should be able to play in a park without losing rep, and you damn right you should be able to play. I, I hate that I keep hitting the mic, man. Um, I. I think that um, I think that that's that's the truth, man. In in some parts, you should be able to go to anywhere and play. Like, what's the point of having a huge, lovely, beautiful city that's that's just that spans the whole whole globe, whole city, and then you can't even play in it, man? It's like uh, you know, it it just is what it is. And then uh, the only opinion that I feel like matters because <laughs> a lot of people said a lot of stuff and they, they don't say if you don't if you're not part of the, of the solution if you're not offering the solution you're just part of the problem in my opinion so uh I, i'm not gonna put those people anybody else up here because these are the only opinions that matter right here so christy t says you guys want the affiliations now they're not good and you know that sounds like a kid a kitty answer or whatever because it's not that simple the man yard man og he says to be fair this wasn't anything like the affiliations that we wanted this, I mean, this, uh, this was how 2K wanted it. They wanted to prove their own point to take it back out. And y'all, and then the OG Grandmaster Sensei says, "On oh God, sad how lame they are." And uh, you know, he just he replying to y'all, man. It's just, it's just, um, it's just how they wanted it to be. They did it. Well, hold up, what it said. This makes so little. What is who this dude doing? This makes so little. Sense. I would, I would, I would. They didn't put all the work in to prove their point. That small, that small mind that we finna have this same city in, what is it? I, I don't even know what he's trying to say. Uh, Y'all sleep, so, so get used to the mayors and the court. Oh, I guess he said, bro, I don't know what he's trying to say. Let me tell you this, man. This is exactly how 2K wanted it. And it's just like, y'all know what people do when they try to prove a point. It's just like we go in the wreck and we say, we're playing zone. And then people be like, all right, we playing zone? Okay, cool. They don't want to play zone. So what do they do when they don't want to play zone? They don't play the zone correctly. And when they don't play the zone correctly, everything gets screwed up. 
and 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 then you know they're trying to prove a point that zone doesn't work or whatever you understand what i'm saying they're trying to prove the point that zone zone ain't gonna work man it ain't gonna work and then they don't play it right and then they give them two or three threes and then boom that's how it is so that's what y'all mind is saying that they put it in here in a way that would not be conducive to what everybody wants to see to prove their own point. That is exactly what happened, and they could fix it. Look, I understand that you want to keep people in their own parks so the parks are full, each affiliation park is full, but at the same time, you want to you want people to be able to spread out and play, but they, they play at a penalty. So, let's just say it like this. It's real easy to fix the problem. I got to do this video with All City. I'm doing it with All, all City. Hit me up today, man. We're going to do this thing. We're going to have an extensive conversation, about a 15-minute conversation about this today and what they can do. This was my idea, and it's very simple. You want to keep people in their parks, but you want to you want to penalize, you want to make it risky for them to leave their uh, their part, their side of the city. I completely understand that. So you want to keep them there, but you want to make it risky. This is what you do. You start the person off. Your first game in a separate park, you're at 50% rep. Boom. If you win that game, your next game, you're going to have 75% rep. Boom. So there's two games. When you go on a three-game winning streak, you are now at 100% rep. And then to compensate for the games that you had before that, when you when you play your uh, when you go on a, a four game winning streak, so at four you should be at 1.2 or 1.25 or something 1.1, just something over what you had, so that you can get more rep and you can compensate for those two those two games that you had. So you start at 50 percent. Game one, you get 50%. That's cool. We run another game. Now I'm at 75% rep. Okay, boom. That's cool. Third game, three-game winning streak, because it's, it's easy to go on three-game winning streak. I was going to say maybe they should do it at five, but I'm looking at it, and I'm like, yeah, five might be a little bit much. So at your three-game winning streak, you're at 100% rep, and everything after that, you get 1.1, maybe 1.2, and that'll compensate for those uh, two, or even 1.25. That'll compensate for those games that you did because if I come to your park and I'm streaking up I should get a reward for doing that I'm in y'all park y'all can't get me out of here I'm king of the hill King Kong ain't got shit on me that's how it should be I should be getting a reward for streaking in your park so let's do it so so at your fourth and every other game you're getting more rep for streaking in another team's park people trying to come knock you off you king of the hill they can't do nothing about it boom that's good that'll do two things Bums are not going to leave the park because they don't want to take that rep beating. And that's number one. And number two, number two, um, they know they're not going to get a three-game winning streak. <laughs> so, you know, they might go over there and try, but they know they're not going to get a three-game winning streak. So they're not going to really leave the park like that. But it would give somebody like me incentive to leave the park because I'm going to leave with my squad. Me and Brute, we're going to go out there. It's very rare that we don't get on a two or three game winning streak and then when we are beating when we are at your park running it up it should change the court it should put a snake on the court like a, a snake um a snake on the court like you know show, show that we're on the court and let everybody in the park know that we're the vipers and we here and we streaking it up in your park come get all the smoke because if that smoke come with some backwoods tell them niggas i want it that's what I'm talking about. We want all the smoke. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That's what I'm saying, man. Or, you know, if you come to my park and you come to the Vipers, my little boy want me to open this thing, bro. I got to be a good daddy. Hey, let me ask y'all this. If you're still here, do you tax your kids? Mm. Do you tax your, kid, tax your kids on the Kool-Aid jammer when they bring it to you like that? Put, put I tax. I tax heavily down. But y'all understand what I'm saying? If the Vipers in your park and they running it up, it should put a snake, the, uh, the, you should put a snake on the court instead of fire around it and all that stuff. Let you know that somebody else is in your park. Everybody should be running over there like King of the Hill. Get these guys up out of here. And if they can't deal with the smoke, they'll get up out the park. It just is that simple. So that, that does two things. You know that if you go to somebody else's park, you're going to have a target on your back. And that's just how it is. And if you play with other people, it'll just be like, hey, you know, it just says somebody from a different affiliation is there. So if I go play with T Mizzle and I'm a Viper and he's from the, he's the Beast of the East, we're still going to have a target on our back because let's say he comes to the Vipers, it's going to have a beast on the court. So it'll say there's a beast on the court or maybe they just have the logos or whatever. And that's who you need to be going to try to get up out of here. Anyway, man, let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. I think it's a dope idea. And I think it's like a mini rivalry day within rivalry day type thing. But you know, it is what it is, man. But uh, just know, we want the smoke. We want the smoke. We want the smoke. We want the smoke. Hey, like I said, man, let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Till next time.
It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK of the People's Town. Guys,